Happy New Year! Welcome back to Seth's Place, your go-to channel for random toys and collectibles. My name is Seth Maleta, your Manila Millennial, and in today's video, I will be showing you guys my current collection. Well, that is just limited to My Hero Academia, Yoda, and Pokemon. But before anything else, let me return Grogu's hat. He is also celebrating New Year with me. <laughs> Um, I've seen you guys comment on my videos asking for a room tour or a collection tour but as of now I can only do a quick shelf tour as you can see behind me in case you are wondering what else I have just keep watching Okay, so we have here the Yori Takara Shelf Medium, of course, that's a smaller one, and the Mega version, the taller one. But before anything else, let's check out Grogu first, or the child, or Baby Yoda, whatever you want to call him. So yes, this is the 10-inch Funko Pop. One of my first few pops, actually. This is the first pop that I've pre-ordered online from Bully Boy Collectibles. We have here the child in a bag, and this is from Mainstream Manila, the plush Baby Yoda or Grogu. Then this is um, a lesson in the force with Yoda. And here is my first um, pop town. This is the hut that Yoda used in Dagoba. The head is still a purple head. And the other versions of Yoda. As you can see, there are a lot of colors here. This is the most expensive of them all because as you can see, it's limited to 2,500 pieces in celebration of Star Wars. Also part of the Galactic Convention. Yeah, so these are exclusives. And we have here, of course, Luke Skywalker video that I had to get one because there's a super small Yoda at the back. And yep, other... Yoda's. It's also super cool because it's glow in the dark. And below that, we have some Pokemons, but with Kaminari Denki from My Hero Academia here. Because if you can remember my previous video, I did say that he kind of reminds me of Pikachu. And other Pokemon Pops. Voltus 5, Hetty. I also kept some of my Switch games here just so it's easily accessible. And of course, I do have wipes here. This is um, Clorox. That's what I use to sanitize the packages that I receive. So I'm sure that they're clean. And over here, the Mega Shelf. So we have here my 10 inch All Might Funko Pop. This is Tokoyami metallic version in the regular one. The Vaulted Tenya and the other characters. That's not all actually because this shelf can house three columns of pops so you can actually see other uh, pops behind. But yeah, they're all My Hero Academia pops here. This part is for All Might. And then Deku, we have here a crying Deku Nandoroid and some effects that I have. Shoto to the Roki together with the Daddy, Angie or Endeavor. And we have here, of course, we're putting the villains on the second row. We have here Himiko Toga, Shigaraki, but of course, I had to put Kurogiri below him. And we have here Dabi, Overhaul, Mount Lady's there, just because I don't know where else to put her. I also got this um, effect. It's actually separate, but I placed it there just for fun. And last but certainly not the least, this is my most favorite part because this features Katsuki Bakugo, my favorite character from My Hero Academia. We have here a couple of WCF figures also here. I have actually completed the WCF line of Bakugo only, of course. I'll show that in a separate video, but yeah, this is a Figma from Pasty and then an Android. Uh, this is a keychain actually of the same size as, as the pop keychain and this one is a Kotobukiya Artifacts J figure and finally something from Good Smile Company again. This is a Pop Operate Bakugo and that is a Chibi Masters Bakugo and a Badsmaru Bakugo. All types of Bakugo. I am still lacking 
Bakugo figures, of course, but I am just waiting for better looking versions of him. I don't want to get the ones that are super angry because you know how weird his facial expressions can be. Yep, that's it. If you guys liked what you saw and or if you want to check out what kind of shelf this is that I'm using, the links are in the description box below. The prices and dimensions are there as well. And also if you want to suggest what other figure or Funko Pop I should collect this new year, please feel free to comment below and let me know your thoughts. Don't forget to subscribe to youtube.com slash sesdemolanta for more unboxing videos and reviews of other toys and random collectibles. My name is Sesdemolanta. Thank you so much for watching. Hi! Happy New Year!